Hello folks, Sam from Florida Guana. I see a lot of folks struggling on the, on the internet, uh, on Facebook, when they have a sick tortoise, especially a small tortoise, they're really struggling to deliver the proper medications and hydration to those animals. Wanted to go over some quick pointers on what we do here and what I feel are really the important points on how we have to approach that sick animal. Number one, we want to deliver antibiotics. If we have, uh, I have a, a, a tortoise we're going to use here, a redfoot tortoise, who has a respiratory infection, so we're going to deliver antibiotics. We're going to deliver sub Q hydration and we're going to tube because you need to have nutrition to, to fight infection. And you've got to remember, keep these guys warm. I want them between 86 and 90 degrees. That keeps their metabolism up and allows them to assimilate the drugs that you put in them. Otherwise, if they're cool, you can put all the drugs you want in the world and it's just going to, it just, it's not going to matter. It's just going to come in and it's going to go out. So we have a little 55 gram red foot tortoise here. I'm going to go over. Um, the, the first part of it, which is actually delivering that medication. So I'm just going to give a little spray of alcohol there. I'm going to hold his feet down. And then just right here in the base of his tail, next to his tail, I'm going to put the antibiotics. That's the antibiotics. And then for the hydration, what I do, he's got his little feet wiggling there. I'm going to take his little feet out. And then... If you check this out, so right here, I'm just sub-Q underneath here, and I'm delivering those antibiotic, uh, th that hydration, just under that skin, you can see how it's bubbled up a little bit. So we've got him as hydration. We're gonna keep this guy warm now, and we're gonna tube him later. I don't tube on the same day, because after you get done flipping them over and everything, you don't wanna take the chance of them of them uh, throwing up, you know, uh, because they're just getting all excited and everything. So. Typically, don't try to tube feed and, and give hydration or antibiotics on the same day if I have to flip them over. So, have a lot more information on my website. Check out my YouTube channel. Let me know if there's anything interested, anything else that maybe you're interested in me going over. I appreciate it, everybody. Give me a call. Give me a text. And remember to, to subscribe. I really appreciate it, folks. Take care.